almost sounded like Final Countdown there for a second. Da -da -da -da. Kind of sounds like Final Countdown. Copyright. Alright, so we know that there's probably if this is the same distance. I know that the, it's gonna be around here somewhere. Theoretically. If we're using if we use this pla this this planet. Um Oh, can you imagine these were Oh my god, I just came up with a sci-fi idea for this game. You, you instead of getting a ship. A spaceship. Just planets all over. But yeah, so the idea is if it's the same distance. Yeah, right around here. Is my theory. So when we get to about here, I believe we're gonna be center. Like in the middle. Um yeah, it's just to our left a little bit. Um, I also have to get food. So let me get... Let's put you on here. Can I start the fire? I can light the fire. So I might as well make some food while we're doing this. Um, let's take potatoes, let's take you. You. If our, bike if our boat catches on fire, you'll know why. I'm s I'm slowly falling out of the boat. Here we go. Look at that. Perfect. Change our course a little to the right. Let's see, we are moving, right? Yeah. Say if we weren't moving, I'd be slightly annoyed. We're just moving extremely slowly. How's our food going? Seven seconds. So I figure we're maybe a third of the way. So I figure here's half. So I figure the other the other islands around here somewhere. According to those two birds. What do they know? Hopefully a lot more than I do. Oh, I just made it. Hey, island right there. Look at that. I kind of know what I'm doing. Two islands in one live stream. What are the odds of that? I'll give you a hint. It's a lot. Like, almost 100%. It's a rainy day, pizza bit. So, what kind of island is this? So we're either looking at desert or tropical again. I'm thinking tropical because there's bamboo trees up on that hill. Let's give a quick little scan. So, on. Um, we 
found this one actually a lot faster. Don't need you. I don't need you. I think this is just, yeah, so this is just another tropical island. Maybe a little flatter? Once again, there are NPCs on all of the islands, apparently, except the starting island. Oh my god, I just came up with an idea. Uh, when you go up north, or in certain areas of the, of the game with biomes, you freeze to death. Even in a small little rinky dick boat. There is a panther over there, just running and sort of running. Oh, okay, this island is a lot bigger than I thought. Alright, so. Plan. We're gonna go around the outside of it like we did the last one. Kind of get a good a little idea and a good situation of the island itself, the size, uh, what it looks like, and all that stuff. And then uh, kind of go from there. So we were right. There were two islands to our south. I wonder if it's... Hmm. So yes, we're looking for points of interest and NPCs. Points of interest and NPCs. There actually might be one right over there. Definitely looks like there's something over there. That just might be the way the the dirt is. But it looks like it was walls there for a second. Oh, I got the I got the sea madness. Nope. Yeah, it's an actual house. Look at that. Boom. And we got a black panther following us. I'm not a villain from Marvel, so he should be walking away, which he is. So we're good. Once again, we're keeping our eye for points of interest like that. And there's a cougar. Some clay. This one's definitely more kind of hilly. Uh, so it's definitely like just fish and stuff. So it's this, uh, the generic fishing hut that show up that that pops up every now and then, as a point of interest. Hoping it was a newer one, but it actually doesn't even look damaged. So this might actually be our outpost for this island. There's an NPC. This is an NPC uh, uh, house. Interesting. This house is half on a dirt bed. Well, let's stop and see what he does. Is he a traitor or is he... His name is just Santiago. It's getting late. I'm leaving soon. Well, okay. I have noticed that they just disappear. So this is Santiago's home. I'm actually going to clear his doorway for him. Oh, he just... Wow, okay. I hope I didn't make him despawn. He did say he was leaving soon. I just killed an NPC, possibly. 
Oh, we're getting some sand though, which is good. Like we break into the guy's house. He took his fish with him. The jerk. And here I was. Trying to help your house look all nice and clean. Santiago. That is his real name. Hey, well, you can go. Um... Was it stuff in the middle is stuff that it was kind of like meh we need but we not need why don't i oh because sand goes in here that's right we already have a ton of it literally like a ton uh, well let's continue on our little adventure well, actually let me look the map real quick okay So far, one NPC is a fisherman who either is a trader, most likely is a trader, and uh, I'm going to assume he's a food trader. I know there's also a soldier. So there's a guy who trades in weapons, there's a person obviously who now trades in potions, and then we have found probably the food trader once he comes back tomorrow. So, so much. I'm still going to... Um, make that my, maybe my starting location for this island. So that way we've got at least, you know, a little outpost on this island. And I want to stop here real quick and look to see what I just saw. Whoa! I think I saw something. Yep. of interest. I'm just going to take the spade. <laughs> Don't want anything else. Just the spade. We can break it and get some extra spare metal. Uh, you can dig that thing up and if I'm not mistaken there's nothing there. So... So I'm looking for birds. Does that tell us if there's any other islands? What looks like there's some islands to the southwest still. So now if we started the no the, the, the top of the map, that wouldn't be too bad. Then everything is just south of us. But I wouldn't mind a really good like pine map or island to go to. No points of interest here. Just lag. From what I'm seeing. Now mind you, later on when we actually land on a spot and stay on that spot, we'll run around and double check all the all the little areas. snakes and spiders spiders hmm I'm a little surprised actually at the lack of stuff here there's one of those magical thingamajigs that wrist hurts
one of the things I don't like about this game is that I get to hold W so bloody much. And then I remember after that that you don't. It's basically just left and right when you're on a boat. There's another cat there. Hmm. Not much actually. Wow. Okay, the silent actually might be a lot bigger than I thought. There's a bird down there to our south. We're going with the wind, but we're also going ridiculously slow. There we go. Am I yawning? It's only five o'clock, jeez. I'm getting old. There is nothing on this island except for that one NPC. And that gravestone. Now mind you, that's from what I can see. That and the lagginess. A lot of bad animals. It's pretty much the exact same as our other island, other than the fact that this one just has no real points of interest other than the NPC in that, oh, there's something right there. Let's see what this is. I think this is just like the thing that we found on the other one, which is just a basically a fire pit. And it is. It's just like the other one. It's a fire pit. Found some fur boots, some leather shoes, a fire starter, a chair. Look at the meat. Oh. Boo! Look at the music sounding all depressing, like. It's even like, but there's nothing to find. How much have we gone around here? Yeah, we've gone around a nice chunk of the island, too. And there's still a lot in the middle of the island, obviously, to, to search for, so. What did I just run aground on? Did I run aground on some, a chunk of coal? Yep. Oh, there's something right there. What is that? That looks like a bonfire or something. It's going to be a bonfire. Did I just hit some more coral again? I did. Right, we're going to... Let's, uh... Call it there for the moment. Iron knife's always good. Some more meat. Logs of wood are always good to take. Ooh, sacks of sacks. Nothing. There's some hides that we can take. Turn that into leather. Because I don't know. Oops. Engineer pole. That's it. Boom! Ha ha. Let's burn it all. I feel extremely hot. Interesting. Uh, 
Let's get some boar's hide, stuff like that. Nothing too crazy. Some logs that we can make another one of those out of if we want to. Other than that, can I make a bed? I need five rope. Boom. Then let's sleep till morning. Listen, that thing will be burning for a long time. Yep, let's take it. Let's continue on our merry little way. Stop, and here we go. Got a nice little, nice chunk of the island so far, but not as good of uh, points of interest as I was hoping. It's kind of open for some more, like, some more fun ones. More, more entertaining ones. But, uh... No dice. So far. Later on, we'll go around, take a look, see what's going on. All the islands are pretty large, so looks like there's some coal or something in that wall, or it's just a generic darkness in the in the stone. All right, so that is definitely the most oh. Crap. The most southern part of that island. So yeah, so where what's his face there was uh, was living is where we're gonna set up our little outpost. Cause there's not much else on this island at the moment. Once we go ashore for a permanent, temp well, for a our, our our temporary location for that for this island, then we will uh, take a break and come back with some stone heart. Actually, this is a relatively flat. Actually, no, we don't. We're probably going to call it. Once we, we land today. Got a bit of a headache. So Saturday's live stream will be ridiculously long. The plan there is just to go for uh, eight hours or so like we did last Saturday. And the plan is for most of these videos are going to be going up on Monday. Uh, the five of them. The plan is to just start uploading massive... Like the... Basically the entire thing cut up into two or three episodes. And that way we'll always have a live stream and always have about five or six episodes of something going up every day. Where was 
uh, Frederick's home then? Yeah, it's around here somewhere. So I'm kind of surprised actually the the lack of uh, stuff here. Though, like I said, we still haven't gone interior to the island yet. There's a cave. Which will be interesting. Uh, I think I saw something. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to lock myself up a little bit. There we go. Line it. You know what? This location is fine. Screw it. I think I saw something over here. Well, this would be a good spot to hide a point of interest. I thought I saw something here. Oh, it must have been maybe the way the bushes were. Maybe in the way the bushes were and the trees. I thought I saw it may have been this tree here. I thought I saw like a like a piece of wood sticking straight out of the ground. Give it a quick little once over. Seen anything really? There's a panther. Hmm. I can go kill the panther, but what's the point? Friedrich or Steve or whatever his name is, just around up here. There's his house there. Can I see it right there through the trees? I think coral's good for paints. We're gonna see if he's uh if he sells stuff or, or what. Yeah, our plan is gonna be to kinda maybe level out this little part that sticks out of the water. And turn it into a like a land dock. So I'm gonna park our boat. Do I have I got this I got the spade on me. Something like right here. There it is. Nice. First things first. Let's get up to him and see if he is good to go today or if we have to wait for the next day. We have to wait for the next day. Yeah, okay, he's a trader. He trades corals, water breathing potions, gold pebbles, fish. He doesn't trade as much. Um, so he is, I, I don't want to say a useless trader, but he has his purposes. His purpose is uh, sea stuff, water stuff. No big deal. So, we're 
we're gonna try to level this out a little bit. There we go. fail horribly at it. Right, I want to level, lower this down then. There we go. is it? This looks like it's going to take a little while to kind of work out. So probably going to have to place sand and stuff. And dirt and try to get this thing going. If not, I mean, worst case scenario, we could always set it up. Even, you know what? Yeah. This is going to take way too much work. It's going to just, yeah, it's way too much work. Especially when we can just make ourselves our own dock. Yeah. Now there is one catch with this guy. So if I try to sell him a fish, he apparently buys fish for a dollar. So now my question is, I can sell him actually stuff I don't need. Okay, stone for example, no you don't want a stone. So if you notice a tin can technically is worth one, but he won't take it. I wonder if you had to build up I guess like a reputation with him. Uh, so you'll have to. F you won't do that. Four. You'll only give me one for it. No. Nope. Maybe he'll only buy stuff that's. Great. Great. Successful. Okay, so is it a one-for-one one deal? Like, did I get gold from that? Like, I don't look like I got gold. It looks like it's just a one-for-one one deal. Okay. Well, that's going to be the end of this live stream. Tomorrow, Saturday... Uh, we're going to have a whole big one. Uh, the usual long, ridiculously long uh, live stream for Saturday. 
Um, just look at this dude's house. How does he do that? Like, it's all placed, too. Not in your house. If it was in your house, I'd be breaking in like this. Interesting. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, live streams tomorrow, Saturday, around noonish is when we'll start. God knows when we'll finish. Uh, lots of gaming, lots of fun, and a lot of stuff. Till then, though, I will. Let's uh, turn to main menu. I will see you guys then. Bye bye. Uh, let's do stream end because I'm a genius.